they're single men. Every woman out there is not for you. Forget the fact that she's beautiful. She carry front, she carry back. It doesn't make her your soulmate. Stay with me in this video and I will explain exactly why. Every single woman on earth was created to serve a need for a man, to fill a void, to help a certain man achieve his purpose in life. So the question is, that woman you're attracted to right now, is she the one that would fill your void, serve you through life and assist you achieve your purpose? Think about it for a second. When God created a man, the first thing he gave him was work. No wonder you guys like to work a lot. In fact, when a man doesn't have work, it's almost as if something is missing, something very big is missing in his life. No wonder. The first thing God gave a man was work. In other words, he gave him a purpose. He gave him duties, what you're supposed to do. He said, this is it. Till the ground, take care of the animals, do something. Before he gave him a woman, which is to serve as a helpmate unto him. So the real truth is that you can never know the right woman for you until you're able to discover your purpose and live in it. If you don't do this, you would never be able to attract the right woman who was supposed to help you, who was predestined for you from the back of time. I'm sure you would have heard this sentence, don't chase women, chase your purpose and you will attract the right woman. Yes. That's very correct. Once you're living in your purpose, it's like taking the center stage and you begin to attract the right kind of friends. You begin to attract wealth that you're supposed to. You begin to attract everything that is supposed to come into your life, including that woman that has been designed for you. So you see, not every woman out there is for you. Forget how beautiful you should do package, you should do this one. No, not be that one, be the cocoa. Because it's possible for you to go through life and live with the wrong woman, which would frustrate you, which would kill your joy and make you not have a fulfilled life. I'm not saying this to scare you, but to point you in the right direction. So think about it. Look at yourself. Do you know your purpose for being in this life? Nobody is just supposed to exist. Just eat, drink, hang out with friends and just do what not. No. We're all here individually to serve a need, to serve one another in different and diverse ways. For example, if your calling in life is to serve in the military, it's not every kind of woman that will want to be in your life. So when you attract the wrong woman and every time she's complaining, you're not always there, I can't live this life, I can't do this, and at the end of the day, she divorces you and leaves you hanging. Would that make her a bad person? Not necessarily. I don't believe that. I just believe that she is not the one. That is the reason why some things would happen. Because trust me, if it is the one who was supposed to help you through life, she would understand. Because you know why? She already knows what she's going into, where she's putting her head. It's as simple as that. She understands. Because when you get bitter and think that a woman who has left you, a woman who doesn't want to understand with you, is just not understanding, she's this, she's that, it's possible that she is not meant for you she is supposed to serve another man maybe she's supposed to be with someone who doesn't have to go to battles and all of that by the way that is just an example it might just be that your calling is to be a pastor or to be an evangelist or to be someone who travels the world you're rarely in one place for up to two weeks or one month you're always traveling trust me it's not every woman that would like to live a life like that we all have our preferences and the things we like so it's important for you to know what your calling is and what your purpose is so that you will be able to attract the right kind of woman. As I said, it's like being in the center stage, locking in. Once you lock in on yourself, on your purpose, you begin to attract the right kind of things into your life. Because the moment you're focused and you're pursuing your dreams and your goals, that woman who is not supposed to be in your life will not come. Do you know why? Because she would see you and she'd be like, mm -mm -mm, this one. Mm -hmm. He's too determined. He won't even look at me. He won't have my time or something. She just knows that this is not my type. I don't want him. But you see, the right kind of woman already understands you from afar because you know your energies would attract. She understands that, okay, this is a doctor. He's always busy. He's always this. And you know, when I get married to him, this is how life is going to be. But I'm thrilled and I'm happy and I'm looking forward to that. That is what happens when you attract the right kind of woman into your life. So the message here is live in your purpose. Discover what your calling is. 
and then you would know what kind of woman you're supposed to have in your life now someone will be like but how do i know what this purpose is I mean, I just know that I went to college, I graduated, I'm working. How do I know what this purpose is? What is this lady talking about? One of the first things you can do in order to discover what your purpose is, is to ask the one who has given you this purpose. And how do you do that? In a place of prayer. Father Lord, you've kept me alive. I'm here I am. What is it that you want me to do, really? Why am I here? And trust me, he would reveal what you're here for. He would reveal the reason why you were created and brought into this life for. But the thing is, you cannot go to God and ask him what your purpose is, except you believe in this God who has created you and given you this purpose. Because some people will say, I don't believe in all of these things. Why would I have to? I just know that this is my reality. This is what I'm going to face. But if you do not believe in him in the first place, you would never understand why you're here. And he cannot speak to you. Because even when he does, you would not understand why. Because you don't believe in him. So, this is the message. The key to discovering your woman, that woman that is supposed to fill your void and help you through life, is to discover your purpose. Because when you live in your purpose, you would naturally attract the right kind of woman. I sincerely hope that this message benefits you in some way. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Wendy Zill. If you like this video, I believe you like this one. I'll see you there.